All right. Well, uh, namaste everyone. Uh, welcome to Hindi University. My name is Ashutosh, and as you know, we meet every Sunday, 9 a.m. U.S. Eastern, and we learn Hindi language. Uh, we've started recently, you know, a, a new theme in which we are going over short Hindi stories. And uh, we are learning Hindi with these short Hindi stories. Okay, so in this class also, we plan to do the same. And for those of you who are new to Hindi University, I mean, you can learn more about us and the other Hindi videos that we have um, at youtube.com slash Hindi University, um, you know, and, uh, and kind of like, you know, pick up the basics. Uh, as I mentioned, you know, in today's class, we'll learn uh, one particular short Hindi story, which is Lion and the Mouse. So most of you probably have heard of this story in one way or the other. In this particular class, we'll try to deconstruct this story into very, very smaller segments. And uh, we'll also have some conversation around it. So before I move you know, further, I just want to make sure the audio is good on the, on the Facebook side. Uh, so just give me a quick thumbs up just to make sure the audio and you can hear me OK. OK, perfect. So I'm getting quick thumbs up there. Um, and. Um, for those of you who are joining us, you know, live on on Facebook, definitely write down which country you are connecting from, uh, so that I can, you know, I can make sure that I, uh, I, you know, keep that in mind. So, again, let's without any further delay, let's we'll start with the story called the Lion and the Mouse. Okay, and I usually like to keep these stories interactive, so I'm going to ask a lot of questions to folks who are on Google Hangout as well as on on the Facebook Live. Okay, um, so I'm going to change some of the exercises as well. So the, the story goes like this. Um, one day, a lion was sleeping in his cave. Okay, so the first exercise that I have for you guys, for everyone, is to translate this this entire sentence in Hindi, okay? And uh, give me a sense of what you think, how will you say the same sentence in Hindi, okay? And how will you deconstruct it, first of all? Okay, how will you deconstruct this sentence uh, in Hindi and uh, share your thought process? So, uh, in, in, because the first sentence I'm gonna have, uh, you know, Chelsea, share her thought process here so chelsea what do you think how how will you say that in hindi okay so i'm not sure about the word for cave but i know one day is ek din uh -huh. a lion was sleeping ek share silver hot ta okay so, so we just need the word for cave okay so one day you mentioned would be ek din yeah ek din and then a lion you mentioned is ek uh, share ek share okay and then you men mentioned was sleeping would be so rahatha so rahatha and uh, okay why do you think it's so rahatha um because sona is to sleep okay. and when you want to say was sleeping you need to take the and a off of the verb sona and rahata. Uh, that's if share is masculine, I guess. If that's it right. was feminine, if it's feminine, then it'd be so Okay. That's that's absolutely right. So ek din ek share, so rahata. So because it's past continuous, you remove na and you put rahata. And if it is a female lioness, it will be so rahiti. Now the question is, how do we say kev in Hindi? So if you don't know, how will you ask someone, you know, you know, the word cave in Hindi? Uh, Hindi mein cave kaise kehte hai? Yeah, Hindi mein cave kaise kehte hai aur cave ko kya kehte hai? So the word is gufa. Gufa. And the way you write it is like you have a ga with u, you have a f and then a, gufa. Okay, can you say it now? Gufa. Okay, now the entire sentence. 
आई थिंक अभी एक दिन अपना अपने गुफे गुफे में एक शेर सो रहा था वन मोर टाइम अपनी अपने सो गुफा इज फेमिनिन ओके अपनी गुफे गुफा में ट्राई इट्स ओके एक दिन अपनी गुफा में एक शेर सो रहा था एक दिन एक शेर अपनी गुफा में इन दिस पार्ट सो रहा था एक दिन एक शेर अपनी गुफा में सो रहा था सो इंटरेस्टिंग थिंग दैट इज लाइक यू नो इन हिस केव ओके सो इवन दो वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट अ मेल लायन but gufa is feminine okay that's why you're saying apni gufa and because it's uh, you know the in is used in a preposition in this case it will be a post position in hindi okay apni gufa mein so raha tha okay so if i were to go back and ask you uh, chelsea um sher kahan so raha tha sher gufa mein so raha tha very good right so sher where was the, the lion sleeping and she said sher he was sleeping in his cave gufa mein so raha tha okay all right so let's keep going so now the next sentence in this case and for those 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 of you who are advanced feel free to write everything in the devanagari script and i'll be glad to kind of review, review it for you okay so let's keep going the second sentence i have in this case is suddenly suddenly a mouse came and started troubling him okay suddenly a mouse came and started troubling him so i'm going to take a quick pause here so that you know folks or on facebook as well you can also you also have the opportunity to deconstruct it and uh, i'm going to ask you to do the same whatever you know chelsea did just now all right so keep going all right so chelsea back to you share your thought process how will you deconstruct this sentence in hindi okay i would do the first part of the sentence first okay so, i know suddenly is achanak okay so suddenly is achanak so for those of you who are new to hindi if, even if you don't know you can always ask hindi mein suddenly ko kya kehte hain and as chelsi mentioned is achanak so the way you write it in devanagari you have a and then you have a ch with a n and then k achanak suddenly okay and then a mouse came ek chuha aya okay a mouse is ek chuha chuha very good so ek chuha one mouse chuha uh, in hindi i mean i know in 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 spanish this is pronounced as, as like uh, like actually j is pronounced as h but i'm writing it as it is chuha aya keep going mm, yes i'm thinking how to say to trouble someone okay try it um let's say you don't know how to say it and you don't have a native person to to converse with mm -hmm. how will you say that can you use trouble as it is with uh, some of the other verbs such as karna yeah that's what i'm going to try okay. or uh, trouble sharur karte Uh, so to hike how do you say that to hike in i mean you can say either you can find a word for it or you can say hike karna 
राइट मैं हाइक कर रहा हूं ओके ओके नाउ डज इट गिव यू एनी क्लू और ट्रबल शुरू करता नो नो इट्स गुड राइट सो एक दिन एक चूहा आया और even if you don't know the word trouble in hindi you can say trouble karne and then what else trouble karne laga okay right trouble karne laga achanak ek chuha aaya now help me here why did you use aaya uh because aya means came and it's masculine because chuha is masculine okay because it's masculine is chuha okay and uh, to come is ana and because it's used in the past tense past you know uh indefinite tense you said chuha aya okay what if it is was a female you know mouse um then i think it changes to changes to chuhia ai yeah. very good it will be chuhia ai okay or trouble karti karne lagi trouble karne lagi very good right so perfect right so achanak ek chuha aaya aur trouble karne laga kisko trouble karne laga sher ko sher ko right he start troubling the lion okay now let's replace it with the hindi word aur pareshan karne laga परेशान द वर्ड इज परेशान ओके परेशान करना टू ट्रबल इज परेशान करना सो राइट डाउन इन योर लिस्ट ऑफ ऑल द वर्ड्स परेशान देर आर मेनी वेज टू से दैट बट दैट्स दैट्स समथिंग वी हैव नॉट लर्न बिफोर परेशान करना ओके सो लेट्स से इफ माय किड्स आर कमिंग एंड रनिंग अराउंड मी एंड दे आर ट्रबलिंग मी आई कैन से बच्चे परेशान कर रहे हैं ओके और स्टॉप ट्रबलिंग मी राइट मुझे परेशान मत करो ओके और वाई आर यू ट्रबलिंग मी आप मुझे परेशान क्यों कर रहे हो ओके मेक सेंस ओके सो अचानक एक चूहा आया और परेशान करने लगा ओके एंड एज यू मेंशन इवन दो इट डजेंट से दैट बट इट्स इट्स इंप्लाइड दैट द द माउस इज ट्रबलिंग लॉयन सो यू कैन ऑल्सो से अचानक एक चूहा आया और शेर को परेशान करने लगा ओके सो बिफोर आई मूव फर्दर लेट मी सी देर आर एनी क्वेश्चन गुड गुड देर आर नो क्वेश्चन ऑन द ऑन द सो आई थिंक ये लान यू ऑल्सो आर द सेम क्वेश्चन सडनली हाउ डू यू से सडनली इन हिंदी सो यू हैव द आंसर द आंसर इज अचानक ओके अचानक ओके नाउ लेट्स कीप गोइंग नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस दर आई हैव The next sentence I have is okay. So lion caught lion caught him in his paw and. started killing him okay so the lion caught him in his paw so this him is you know basically for the for the mouse okay and this his is for the lion right i mean so the lion caught him in his paw and started killing him so if you think about it it's the same pattern as last time it's the last sentence started troubling him or started killing him so you can tell that you know uh, you know there will be use of similar pattern like in the last one it was pareshan karne laga in this case it should be um, i'm going to give you some hint right dash dash laga okay so again try to deconstruct it um alicia raise your hand if you want to you know try this one i'm going to try it like try the first one don't worry about Uh, okay. 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 Uh, yeah. Can you hear me? Yes. 
Yep, I can hear you. Okay. Okay, so Lion would be share. Okay, Lion would be share. So share ne. Uh -huh. Uh yeah, uh, catch. Um, I don't think I know how to say. So. So just say catch karma, right? Catch karma in the you know. So in the past tense it would be. Uh, catch catch karma. So. Uh, so in the past it would be karna becomes a uh, kya um, so mouse is chuha, chuha. Uh -huh. so shen uh, uh, chuha uh, go very good very good awesome Okay, uh, yeah. Um, okay, very good. Okay, we mouse ko catch kia in his paw. Apne, yeah. apne paw mein, okay, it's okay. Apne paw mein, very good. And we'll go over these words again. I think mouse you mentioned it. We'll go over the, the, the words in Hindi. Okay, and? Paul? Uh, yeah. Uh, aap, aapko marna laga? Okay, marne laga. And started Mar killing him. Or? Kisko marne laga? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, is, uh, yeah, is, usko. Usko, very good. Usko. Marna. Marne. Laga. You know what? It's, it's, I, I didn't expect that. I mean, uh, amazing. Right? You were able to deconstruct it and you were able to translate the entire thing in Hindi. Right? So it's, it's, it's very good actually. Right? So you can see Lion caught him. Right? Share ne mouse ko catch kia. Okay? Now, the same thing we can say. I think mouse you already mentioned chuha mouse is chuha but because there is a post position after that you know there will be an oblique case of mouse or chuha so the oblique case of chuha becomes chuhe okay sher ne chuhe ko catch kiya okay to catch is pakadna let me just write it in a different uh, ink so to catch is pakadna Okay, so now it becomes so I'm gonna say to catch is pakarna. Okay, so in the past tense it would be share ne chuhe ko pakarna becomes instead of catch kia, you can say pakara or pakad liya. Okay, share ne chuhe ko pakada. Apne paw me. Okay, paw is nothing but panja. Okay, paw is panja. But uh, because there's a post position after that, the oblique case of panja would be panje me. Okay, so you say share ne chuhe ko. Share ne chuhe ko apne. Share ne chuhe ko apne panje. Again, this is a you know j sound panje me shirne chuhe ko apne panje me pakada pakada and started killing him and then you got it right or usko marne laga got it right so i'm going to ask you some more follow on questions on it alicia um shir ko marne laga Shir. Isko marne laga. Um, I, sorry, I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't understand what. Okay, so the, it's a follow up question based on the sentence. You, yes. The sentence is Sher ne chuhe ko panje me pakada or usko marne laga. Okay, I'm asking you, Sher, kisko marne laga? Oh, uh, chuhe ko. Chuhe ko marne laga. 
शेर चूहे को क्यों मारने लगा क्यों इस वाई वाई या क्यों आया क्योंकि चूहा क्योंकि क्योंकि चूहान ने शेर को परेशान किया दैट्स राइट क्योंकि चूहा ने चूहे ने शेर को परेशान किया और यू कैन से क्योंकि चूहा शेर को परेशान कर रहा था बिकॉज़ द द माउस वाज ट्रबलिंग ओके भाई गुड जॉब गाइस लेट्स कीप गोइंग द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस आई हैव इज The next one I have is mouse. The mouse requested. The mouse requested lion to forgive him. The mouse requested lion to forgive him. Okay, um, I'm going to take a pause here uh, to see if you guys have any questions. So, and I, I can see Ria, you also said, "Because Chuhe ne Sher ko pareshan kiya," which is absolutely right, right? Because you know, uh, because that is the that's how we will say that. Okay, so this one I'm going to give opportunity to folks who are watching live on on FaceTime. Mouse requested lion to forgive him. okay so you know um i know most of you who are watching live so uh, i'm not going to give take name here but um, try to deconstruct this sentence how do you say that mouse requested lion to forgive him okay there's usually a delay uh, you know so Right. So, um, Chelsea, you want to give it a try? Okay. okay. Um, for the first part of the sentence, I'm thinking, uh, do have mm -hmm. share ko pucha? Okay. Chuhe ne. So, okay. So the mouse is chuha, but you said post position after that ne. Ah, uh, chuhe ne. चूहे ने so, चूहा बिकम्स चूहे चूहे ने शेर ओके okay. शेर को पूछा mm -hmm. पूछा ओके okay. चूहे ने शेर को क्या पूछा आई एम थिंकिंग हाउ टू से माफ करना इज टू फॉरगिव ओके दैट्स राइट टू माफ टू फॉरगिव इज माफ करना is it pucha did he ask or did he you know to ask yeah. or to, to 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 say right I, yeah i would just use the word pucha because that's a word that i know okay. <laughs> that's good um uh, but we can use a different word okay there are many ways to say that right sher ne chuhe chuhe ne sher ko bola you can say that like in a very simple way bola aur kaha right to say or to tell is bolna aur kehna or in this case request kiya you can say that to ko bola let's say for the sake of simplicity bola chuhe ne sher ko bola mujhe mujhe maaf kijiye mujhe maaf kijiye okay that's right mujhe maaf kijiye again this is a j sound chuhe ne sher ko bola कृपया मुझे माफ कीजिए ओके ना फॉलो अप क्वेश्चन चूहे ने माफी क्यों मांगी क्योंकि 
शेयर चूहे को मार करते हैं ओके क्योंकि ऑलमोस्ट दे रहे हैं क्योंकि शेर चूहे को मारने वाला था द लाइन वॉज अबाउट टू किल पहुंचने वाला था ओके ओके वॉट डू थिंक विल हैपन शेर क्या करेगा One day, the mouse said, "One day, I shall return this favor." Okay, the mouse said, "One day, I shall return this favor." Alicia, you want to give it a try? This is a bit. Okay, so Chuhe. Uh, most of um, so is, uh, in, uh, to say is um, what? Uh huh. Uh huh. So, so this one will be the mouse said will be. Chuhe ne kaha. Chuhe ne kaha. Awesome. Chuhe ne kya kaha? Uh, one day, uh, ek din. एक दिन मैं uh, एक दिन मैं मैं डन दिस फेवर आई एम नॉट हाउ टू से सो ओके यू कैन से इंग्लिश वर्ड दैट्स फाइन ओके मैं Can I say my favor return? Karunga. Very good, right? My favor return. And tell me, tell me a little bit about why did you use Karunga? Ah, uh, future. Future, very good, right? Because it's shall return, right? So you said my favor return. What was the base verb? What was sorry? The verb verb here. Karna. Karna, right? So the verb was karna, and because it's future indefinite, you converted mm -hmm. that verb into a uh, karunga. Okay. If it yeah. was a, if it was a, you know, the the female mouse, it will be my return, my favor return. Okay. Karungi. Karungi. Very good, right? My favor return karungi. Awesome. Um, Chelsea, do you know the word for to return a favor? How do you say it in Hindi? I'm not sure for the word favor. Return can be vapas. Vapas, okay. Return can be vapas, but what about favor? We don't know that yet, right? So, um, so the word here is like, you know, I'm gonna erase it. To, to return a favor is asan chukana. To return favor, and there is some Urdu in it. so it's basically ehsaan eh san chukana ehsaan so you the way you write it is you have a and then h s with a and then you have a ch with u k with a and then n with a ehsaan chukana okay ehsaan chukana Repeat after me. Asan, chukana. Okay. Um. Same thing. Like let's say if somebody is paying off the debt. Okay. You can say to debt is nothing but you know uh you know, bhaj or kar. 
actually the arch is interest right so to to pay off the 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 thing is like that you know it's basically uh kar or tax chukana okay kar chukana so you can use that in in many context okay so essentially you will still say the same right the mouse said juhe ne bola i'm going to erase it so more or less the sentence will remain exactly as what alicia mentioned chuhe chuhe ne bola ek din main aapka the word is not written your but it's basically main aapka ehsaan and chukana becomes chukaunga chukaunga ओके okay. एक दिन मैं आपका एहसान चुकाऊंगा वन डे आई विल रिटर्न योर फेवर ओके लेट्स कीप गोइंग द नेक्स्ट वन आई हैव इज द नेक्स्ट वन है द लॉयन लाफ the lion laughed and went inside his cave so now you know the word for cave also so it should be hopefully it should be straight forward okay the lion laughed and went inside his cave okay try to deconstruct it take your time Okay, take your time. You know the word to laugh. Okay, you know the word to go, which is jana, but it's used in the past tense and uh, it's an irregular word. Okay, you know the key word inside and you know the word for cave. Chelsea, you want to give it a try? Okay. Mm hmm. Sher hasa or gufa me aya. okay went sher hasa and and went inside his cave sher hasa or aur gufa mein aaya uh to come is ana to go is okay aur gufa mein gaya okay and his cave aur अपने गुफा अपनी गुफा में आया नो शेर हंसा और अपनी गुफा में गया हसन ओके इट्स ए रेगुलर वर्ब रिमेंबर लाइक यू नो दे डोंट फॉलो द पैटर्न इट्स नॉट यू नो लाफ 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 राइट लाइक इंग्लिश सो गो इन इंग्लिश आल्सो इट्स गो वेंट एंड देन गॉन राइट सो सिमिलरली इज uh jana is to go gaya is the past form right so as you mentioned sher hasa aur apni gufa mein gaya or you can also say chala gaya either way is fine chala gaya you can say that as well now the follow up questions uh sher kyon hasa शेर हंसा क्योंकि चूहा ने कहा कि एक दिन वो एहसान चाहू चुकाएगा चुकाएगा तो उसमें हंसने की क्या बात है What's there to laugh? क्योंकि वो चूहा है और वो छोटा वो छोटा है ओके okay, क्योंकि वो चूहा है और वो छोटा है ऑसम राइट awesome, right? एंड शेर को क्या लगा शेर को लगा कि छोटा जानवर कैसे मदद करेगा राइट 
सो द लॉयर डेफिनेटली शेर को लगा कि वो पावरफुल है और चूहा बिल्कुल यू नो चूहे में कोई ताकत नहीं है राइट पावर पावर नहीं है ओके नाउ द नेक्स्ट थिंग इज वन डे वन डे दंटर एक्चुअली अ हंटर a hunter trapped lion in his net okay one day a hunter trapped the lion in his net alicia you want to give it a try unmute yourself just give me one minute mas okay okay uh well one day is a thing and uh, yeah a hunter is yeah um hunter is right yeah um it okay shikari shikari oh, okay okay shikari you can say hunter also but that's a word shikari <laughs> and it's masculine yeah that's right shikari shikari is masculine okay a uh, crab lion in his neck mm. yeah so yeah again i i don't know any of the words except lion <laughs> 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 so ek din ek shikari uh ne i guess shikari ne uh can i say trap kiya no awesome keep going shikari ne uh share ko okay shikari ne share ko uh yeah trap kiya very good trap uh, kiya uh, trap kiya and then yeah in his net uh so uh, aap ne wo net वेरी गुड राइट एक दिन शिकारी ने शेर को शेर को अपने नेट में यू वॉन्ट बिलीव हाउ हाउ एक्साइटेड आई हैम सो द कॉन्सेप्चुअली दिस सेंटेंस इज एब्सोलूटली करेक्ट एक दिन एक शिकारी ने शेर को अपने नेट में ट्रैप किया आई मीन एज फार एज वोकेबलरी वर्ड्स आर कंसर्न आई ऑनेस्टली एम आई एम लिल बिट आई मीन आई एम आई एम हैप्पी विद इट बिकॉज दीज थिंग्स कैन ऑलवेज बी लर्न अपने जाल में ओके नेट इज नथिंग बट जाल द वे यू राइट इट इज देवनागरी इज जल विथ आ एंड देन लर्न इट्स लाइक जल इज वॉटर जाल इज द नेट शेर सो शिकारी ने शेर को अपने जाल में ट्रैप किया ओके सो इफ यू डोंट नो द वर्ड ट्रैप टू ट्रैप इट्स यू कैन से दैट ट्रैप किया ओके इफ यू नो द वर्ड यू कैन से इधर यू कैन से यू कैन ऑल्सो से टू कैच पकड़ लिया ओके द वे इट्स रिटर्न इन टेक्स्ट बुक्स इट्स जकड़ लिया जकड़ जकड़ना इज टू ट्रैप you know uh jakad liya you can say jakad lena becomes jakad liya or you can also say pakad liya caught him okay so ek din ek shikari ne sher ko apne jaal mein jakad liya okay now the follow up question is uh sher ko kisne jakad liya sher ko sher ko शेर को किसने जकड़ लिया किसने हु किसने शिकारी शिकारी ने राइट अ हंटर हंटर ट्रैप ओके व्हेन यू वांट्स टू यू हैव टू रिपीट ने आई मीन इफ यू वांट्स टू से अ हंटर डिड यू हैव टू से इट शिकारी ने शिकारी ने दैट्स राइट शिकारी ने Yeah, so you say share ko shikari ne jakad liya. Okay. Um, okay. A follow-up question for you, Chelsea, is um, 
शिकारी ने शेर को कैसे जकड़ा और पकड़ा आ, शिकारी ने जल ने जकड़ लिया शिकारी ने शेर को जल जाल 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 में जकड़ लिया ओके दैट्स राइट शिकारी ने शेर को जाल में जकड़ लिया और पकड़ लिया ऑसम लेट्स कीप गोइंग सो द नेक्स्ट वन आई हैव The next one I have lion cried for help. The lion cried for help. Okay, the lion cried for help. Let's see how our folks are doing on the live Facebook side. Let me see if there are any questions. बहुत मुश्किल ये ना no no <laughs> it's fine it's not बहुत मुश्किल I mean, you guys are doing great, right? So I don't see what is difficult. <laughs> okay, so um, I'm going to give this one to Chelsea again. Lion cried for help. Okay, I'm thinking of the word for to cry. I know there's Rona, but I don't think maybe that's not the word we use here. Yeah. It might be more like to shout. Uh huh. Um. I think. Chilana. That's right, right. So the word here is chillana. Chill. I mean, it's literally like chill and lana, but it's one word, right? So chillana. So chi and half la, la with a and then na. So in general, to cry is rona, but in this case, you know, uh, the lion is basically, you know, he's crying for help. Okay. So the lion cried. So how will you say that? The sentence: The lion cried for help. Share. Chilla. Past tense. Um. Hmm. How will you say for help? Madad ke liye. Share madad ke liye. Very good, right? So help is madad. So you say share madad ke liye. So similar to ana becomes aya, chillana becomes. Ah, uh, chillaya. Very good, right? Chillaya. Share madad ke liye chillaya. What was the thing that was? uh blocking you like you know share your thought process um i was just trying to think of the past tense like oh. sometimes like uh for chalana like sometimes like bolna is could be like bola that's right so that's how i was thinking chala yeah that's yeah so that's that's a very common confusion especially in the past tense because past tense can be the rules can be different for regular verbs as well as irregular verbs sometimes they are not related like in this case at least you know it was somewhat related with chillana right um some of the irregular verbs you know for example jana you know the past tense has you will not say jaya it's gaya so it has no relationship with you know the base form so it's a very common confusion the reason i ask you because a lot of time other like you know hindi learners they have a similar confusion so you being a little bit advanced you know you if you share this thing with everyone they they will get like the sense that you know it's not only them but also like you know other people can also have this this confusion right so mm -hmm. it's a, it's a genuine one okay now the next one is um the next one i have is after hearing after hearing the after hearing the lions roar 
uh, the the mouse came after hearing the lion's roar the mouse came to help him the mouse came to mouse came to to rescue him or help him right so the mouse came um alicia you want to give it a try i'm going to unmute you Give me just one minute. Oh. Yeah, try it again. Uh, hello? Yeah. You can hear him. Okay. So after hearing the lion's roar. Hmm. Okay. Uh, uh, I guess I have to start with. Uh, the lion's roar, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> so uh, roar. Uh huh. And after hearing, uh, hear key, roar. Roar. Um, to hear is okay. To hear is sunna. Okay. Yeah. To hear is sunna. And after hearing becomes sunkar. Very good. After hearing is sunkar. It's a share key roar sunkar. Share key roar sunkar. Share key roar sunkar. Uh, 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 the mouse Madad Karne Aya. Okay, Juha Madad Karne Aya. Ah, Madad Karne Aya. Help him. Ah, eh, Usko. Juha? Juha Uski. Very good. Uski. Uski. Madad Karne Aya. Very good, right? So, Juha Uski Madad Karne Aya. Awesome. So, what she said is Sher Ki Roar Sunkar. Okay? Uh, Sher Ki Roar Sunkar, Juha Uski Madad Karne Aya. And Roar is nothing but the hard. That's the word which is used for, particularly for, for any kind of wild animal, primarily for, for the lion. Right? Sher Ki Dahar Sunkar. It's a very interesting thing that you know you mentioned sunkar after hearing, right? After, whenever you have this kind of a you know scenario, like after coming to to office, you know uh, I will work office akar, like after coming is office akar. So ana and then you put you know kar after that office akar, or after eating I will sleep, khana khakar me songa. Okay. Um, after teaching, um, I will go out. Padhakar main bahar jaunga. Okay. So the verb, the way you're doing the conjugation, you're removing, uh, you know, sunna is the base verb here to hear. But you remove na and you put kar, right? Sunkar. Um, so, you know, if you're, if you're into Bollywood songs and the old songs, you should search Chukar, Chukar Mere Man Ko. That's a very famous song. Right? Chukar. Uh, Amitabh Bachchan is singing that song. And Chuna is to touch. Okay. And then he's saying, like, you know, Chukar Mere Man Ko. Like, you know, you touch my heart. Right. After touching my heart, you, you, you know, you told me something. So, I mean, this is just like a, you know, a, a slight tangent. But, you know, if you Google it, you'll be able to uh, get the song. Okay. Um, all right, so let's keep going. Share ki dahar sunkar, chuha, chuha uski madad karne aya. Okay, now the next one I have is, um, how are we doing with time? I think we just have, yeah, we are doing okay. We're almost done as well. So he cut the mouse, uh, cut the 
the the net the the mouse you know cut the net with his with his strong teeth okay the mouse cut the net with his strong teeth uh, you want to try Chelsea this one okay I need to think for a few seconds yeah yeah take your time <laughs> Okay, to say cut, do we say chuhene katkia? Okay, you can say that. Give it a try. Okay. First, let's deconstruct it and then we'll combine the sentence. Okay, yeah, so the first thing I thought was chuhene jal katkia. Okay. okay, so first thing is the mouse cut the chuhene. Okay, so first of all, why do you use ne here? Share your thought process. Chuhe ne. Mm -hmm, because it's past tense, and then there's also an object in the sentence, so it's okay. probably a, I think, transitive verb. It's a transitive verb, right? Because chuhe ne, and it's a past tense, and there's a direct object that he is cutting a net. Chuhe ne. Jal. Okay, chuhe ne jal. Uh, cut kia. Okay. We'll come back to you know how do you say cut uh, you know cut kia and mm -hmm. with his strong teeth. So I think you yeah, start with teeth don't Daunt. or strong could be taze or could be must boot maybe I think taze. Right. So it could be taze or must boot. Must boot. Mazboot is the word which we'll be using in this case. Okay. You have jal cut kiya. Um, uski mazboot dant ke liye. No, his whose teeth? With the mouse's teeth. Uh, so it would be apne. Apne? Apne mazboot daant. So plural oblique case would be? Daante. Daanto se. Daanto. Remember like ladke becomes ladko. Hmm. Ladko se or similarly. So daant is like singular as well as plural. Okay. Um, you know, but when you're using the oblique case, it would be daanto se. So the sentence is chuhe ne. Jal ko apne majboot daato se cut kiya. So cut kiya will come towards the end. Right? Cut kiya. Okay? Uh, and believe me or not, uh, you know, to cut is, you know, in Hindi is kaatna. Kaatna. Okay? To cut is kaatna. Uh, and the way you write it in Devanagari, you have a K with A and then T with N and then A, Kartna. Okay, so how will you say, what is the past form of Kartna? Take a guess. Um, kata. Kata, very good. Kata, very good. <laughs> So the answer would be chuhe ne jal ko chuhe ne jal ko apne majboot daato se either you can say kata or kaat diya okay if you want to use the perfect tense then you can say kaat diya both of them are correct. Chuhe ne jal ko apne majboot daato se kata or kaat diya. Okay. Now, follow up question. Chuhe ne kya kiya? 
चूहे ने शेर की मदद कैसे की चूहे ने चाल को काटा काटा चूहे ने जाल को काटा ओके um, शेर ऐसा क्यों नहीं कर पाया क्या हाउ कम शेर शेर ने शेर ऐसा क्यों नहीं कर पाया शेर अपने आप को क्यों नहीं बचा पाया hmm. शेर अपने आप को क्यों नहीं बचा पाया पता नहीं क्यों <laughs> पता नहीं क्यों ओके डिड यू यू अंडरस्टूड द क्वेश्चन हां व्हाट क्या था क्वेश्चन क्या है व्हाई कैन द लायन फ्री हिमसेल्फ और व्हाई कैन द लायन कट इट हिमसेल्फ या 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 मेक मेक अप द आंसर क्योंकि जाल हाथों में है ओके okay. जाल उसके ऊपर है बिकॉज़ द द यू नो द ट्रैप इज ओवर हिम जाल शेर के ऊपर है ओके mm-hmm. okay. um okay so hence the 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 lion's life his life was saved and shere bach gaya okay uh, that's that was pretty much it about the story okay so more importantly um i mean i know these things are like for these are usually kid story but um, for the sake of the conversation um is story ka moral kya hai chelsea hmm मॉरल है कि आप मदद आप मदद करना Mm-hmm. thinking how to say you should ab uh, chahiye right ah aap aapko madad karna chahiye aapko madad karna chahiye one should help okay uh, um so in this case who does it apply to like you know kisne kiski madad ki sab kuch agar aap agar uh chote दोस्त mm-hmm. या छोटे लोग mm-hmm. आपको मदद चाहिए mm-hmm. तो आपको मदद करनी चाहिए सो बेसिकली छोटा या बड़ा कोई भी आपकी मदद कर सकता है राइट एनी बडी कैन हेल्प यू इधर दे आर स्मॉल और बिग राइट सो द लॉयन लाफ्ट शेर हंसा क्योंकि क्योंकि चूहा छोटा जानवर Hair, right? The lion laughed because you know uh, the mouse is a small animal, but still, mouse was able to help him. Share, फिर भी, but still, फिर भी, चूहे ने शेर की मदद की और करी. Okay, so I hope uh, this was challenging enough for 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 you guys and for folks who are watching uh, live on Facebook. Uh, definitely, you know, share it with more people. um join us on the the live you know interactive session as well so you can really help build the story um next week we'll we'll meet again with another interesting story and uh, i'm going to ask a lot of follow up questions so you guys can think ahead and like you know uh, not only just translate but also build more on top of it so with that in mind i'm going to stop the the broadcast thing so you know uh you know we can take any questions and comments from the panel So, so I'm gonna stop here as well. Thanks.